Hello and welcome to the channel. And the video today is compression testing. So let's get into it. So sorry about the background noise, it's the weekend. Every man and his dog's got his mower out. We'll just do the best we can. Here's a compression tester. It's easy to test the compression and these kits if you don't already have one they're cheap to buy i think i paid 23 dollars from ebay for this one let's have a look what we get set of instructions easy to follow and what you'll need to do is pick the correct size adapter to fit into the cylinder head of the posty so remove the spark plug and the spark plug on the posty is 12 millimeter which is this one and what we do Screw that onto the hose. This then screws into the cylinder head and the gauge clips on like this. The gauge will record the maximum pressure and stay there until we press this button to reset it back to zero. One thing I did learn with this though, if you just put this on finger tight like that, when you screw it into the cylinder, and you screw it pretty pretty tightly when you undo it to take it out what will happen the hose will unscrew and you will be left with this adapter stuck in the cylinder in the recess of the cylinder and it's an absolute pig an absolute bugger to remove so what i did what i suggest that you do is when you put this on use some grips or some pliers and nip it together and tighten this up that way when you undo it to remove it the whole lot will come out you won't be left with the adapter in the cylinder head so now we've got the tester the gauge screwed in there and we're going to kick the bike over now you need to have the throttle wide open, make sure the choke's not on, and give the bike several good kicks. The gauge will stop and record the maximum pressure. Some people say you should do it hot, some people say you should do it cold. So what we're going to do, we're going to do it both ways and see if, if there is a difference. First of all we're going to do it without opening the throttle see what difference that makes and we'll kick it all in now open the throttle as you can see Opening the throttle makes a big difference. So as you can see, I've taken the bike for a ride. It's well up to operating temperature. Engine's nice and hot now. I've put the compression tester back on and we'll test the compression again to see if there's any difference between a hot engine and a cold engine. Some people say that you should never remove a spark plug from a hot engine. The thread can pick up. I've never found that to be the case. But if it's happened to you, you're obviously going to be reluctant to remove a plug from a hot engine. The Honda manual says uh, warm, a warm engine, which I presume they mean operating temperature. And the theory behind it is that the piston, with the uh, engine warmed up, the pistons are expanded, you're getting a better seal and uh, more compression. But let's have a look. I tested it before, and I think it was about 135. PSI. We'll try it again now. See what happens. Apologise for the wobbly camera. Throttle open. So as you can see, 
just about 135 psi. Now 135 psi is a bit low, Honda say 142 to 170, so it's just on the low side. So what, what you can do to find out a bit more what the problem might be, squirt a few mils of oil into the cylinder, about a teaspoonful, and then retest the compression. If the compression stays the same, that means that the piston and rings are fine, the problem is in the valves. If you put some oil in and the pressure goes up, that means that the problem is with the bore, the cylinder, the rings, or the piston, something like that. Let's put some oil in and see what happens. So here we go. A little bit of oil. And I'll screw the tester back in and see what happens. So with the oil in the cylinder, test the compression again and you can see it's gone up by about 5 psi. So it's now on 145. So that's about it for compression testing. I hope you enjoyed it and got something out of it. All that's left for me to do, wait for the billy to boil and have a nice coffee and relax and enjoy. Thanks for watching.